Hey, it's Mark Ferguson with Investor More, and I am standing outside a bar that we bought, oh, about a month ago, maybe a little longer. And um, we are doing a few things to it right now, so we're going to walk you through it and show you what we're doing, what our plans are, and talk about all of that. And of course, check out InvestorMore.com for more information on our flips, rentals, being an agent, all of that good stuff. And um, we have many more videos on YouTube of our house flips, um, commercial rental properties, residential rental properties. So we love seeing new subscribers and we love it when people like our videos as well. So keep that up. Uh, this is a bar that uh, we bought from the MLS, the multiple listing service, like I said, about a month, month and a half ago. It had been uh, Dick's Tavern since 1940. Um, and we repainted it and we did do a, some work to the outside. Uh, we haven't done a whole lot to the inside yet, but we'll show you what's going on here. And every time we come here, oh, somebody stops by and wants to come have a drink. So <laughs> there they are. Uh, this is the bar. It's not very big. And Nikki, my project manager and I have decided to run it. So a lot of people have told us it's really dumb, really stupid to do that. But uh, it's so small, um, we're planning to do it. We're planning to hire people to do everything. We're not gonna be here being bartenders or anything like that. But um, that is the plan for now. I've wanted to kind of diversify into some actual kind of brick and mortar businesses and this would be that diversification. So in here, and maybe you guys can tell me what you think of our plan. Uh, we're gonna just take out this old bar. It's pretty beat up. It's made of wood paneling. It's not in real great shape and we're going to shrink it. So right now there's room for like two or three tables and our plan is to shrink this bar to maybe half its size, cut over across right there and then we'll have this open for seating here too. We have outside seating right there and this liquor license also allows the whole parking lot to be used as seating too, outside. So it has a lot of advantages to it. Um, what we've been doing so far is uh, getting the liquor license transferred over to us because, you know, it is active, but we have to switch it over. So I had to go get fingerprints, get a background check, apply for that. Uh, we have come up with a name. So it's going to be called Tavern 85 because this is Highway 85. And we both decided Dick's was not a good name for a bar anymore. Um, and we'll be doing kind of minimal work back here, just cleaning things up, flooring, some paint, and whatever else we need to do to run a bar. We really don't know what we're doing, but we'll figure it out along the way. That's how a lot of things I've done over the years have worked out. So <laughs> just start doing it and see how it happens. Um, storage back here. They left us some inventory still, so some of that left and some other interesting things. We've been doing some trash out. Actually, my nephew was helping doing that. He was really interested in helping with that. Um, so we've been making a little bit of progress, not a ton. Now we really need to kind of get going on making big design, design decisions and moving forward with our plan. And also, I think we're going to just plan to take out the drop ceiling if we can. If it's possible, there's some obviously cracks and work that needs done up there, but it's so low and ugly and it would really make it so much bigger feeling if you could raise that ceiling two feet since it is so small. So that will be one of our plans as well. Uh, the furnace is 35 years old, that sucker right there. So that will be replaced and a new air conditioner will be installed too. We did buy, it's for, 132.5 so that was the bar and the property so that's one reason why I bought this was because it was so cheap so even if we you know start it decide it's too much work we can always lease it out to someone else rent it out to another business it's not the end of the world and so we're leaving our options open where hey if we figure out it's way too much work just too much to take on then we'll jump out of it let someone else take it over but for right now, our plan is to uh, get moving with it and see how it goes. And, you know, we may work on it for a couple weeks. Be like, oh, this is a stupid idea. And then <laughs> let someone else take it over. We'll see.
so that's the place um that's the plan for right now let me know what you think and uh, we'll have more updates on this as we move along as we progress do some remodels and hopefully that beeping stops whatever that is because it's been going for a while <laughs> uh yeah we'll be back with more soon uh, like i said we appreciate all the likes comments so keep those coming and um we'll see what happens with this next